Hi Jurassic Beauties, Winnie here. Today we're going to draw a bear holding a heart. So let's get started. To draw this sweet teddy bear, let's first start by drawing an oval for the mouth and nose area. So I'm going to come right here and draw a curve. And I'm going to round it off on the sides to create my oval and connect it at the bottom. Okay, so we have an oval in. Let's come right to the top right here and I'm gonna draw another curve right in the center. And I'm gonna round off the edges and I'm making my nose pretty big. So a big nose for my teddy bear and connect it in the center. And I'm gonna to come to the top right here and just create another oval and shade everything else in so you can see a little bit better. there. Okay, so now that we have the nose in, let's come right down the center and draw a straight line. And we're going to curve it out on both sides for our mouth and cap it off. For a very happy and sweet bear, right? <laughs> okay, so we have that in. Now let's draw the eyes. We're going to come to the top right here on this edge and just go ahead. It's going to be stuck right on it. So just go ahead and draw a big circle. And same thing over here. Okay, so let's make them draw so cute eyes. I'm going to come in here with two small circles for highlights and a curve line at the bottom and shade in the top. And lines at the bottom. And same thing over here. So I really hope this bear drawing here holding a heart inspires you to draw this for someone you love be it for father's day mother's day for your grandparents someone you just anyone that you love <laughs> your friends for yourself <laughs> i just really hope you love this drawing and you have fun drawing it okay so with the eyes in so then let's come above each eye and i'm just going to draw a soft curve above each eye Oh, so sweet, right? Okay, so then from there, let's draw the head. So I'm going to come above where the eye is, right at this tip, come out oh, about this much. And I'm going to go ahead and draw a curve. So it's going to be a little bit wider right here and come down. And same thing over here. So about this much. And come down. So now that I have that pretty even, I'm going to build the top. So we're just going to go up nice and round and towards the center right here. I'm just going to draw a little tuft of fur. So as we come to the center about right there, I'm going to stop and just draw two curves and then bring it down on the other side back to the other side right here and connect there. So then from there, let's come to this edge and we're going to draw the ear. So about right here. Let's go ahead and draw a big curve. And then I'm going to draw another curve inside. And same thing on the other side. So I'm just going to drag some points across just so I know where my other ear should go because I'm drawing pretty big, so it's just much easier. So from there, I'm just going to go ahead and round it off and bring it right back in. And same thing, just draw the inside. Okay, so now that we have that part in, let's draw the heart. So I'm not going to finish the face yet because it all depends on how big my heart is, right? So I'm going to come right underneath the mouth 
say about right here. I'm just going to give myself a point right in the center. From there, I'm going to start to draw the heart. I'm going to go up close to the mouth area. And I know I want my heart pretty big, so I'll end it about right here. So let's say about right here, I'll end it. And same thing on the other side. So I'm just going to drag this point across, approximate, same height. Okay, and then I'm going to bring it down just like the other side. So it's about the same area, but right here. About right here. And let me level it so it's the same on the both sides. And then from there, I'm going to draw and stop and draw the hand. But if you're using a pencil, go ahead and finish your heart first. So I'm going to stop right here and pop out the hand. So come right here, pretty big bare paw. And basically kind of like drawing an oval. And connect. So you just want to pop it out. Then you can come in here with two curves for some detail. And same thing on the other side. So we're pretty even. So once again, I'm just going to drag a point across so I know kind of where to end. And I'm going to pop out a curve and connect it once again, just like the other side. And once again, two curves inside for some detail. From there, let's go ahead and finish this heart and I'm going to make it really big. So use this as your guide, come straight down and say about right here. I'll stop, give myself a point. And so that's where I know I'm going to go back to. So I'm going to go ahead and continue this out and just go ahead and connect it back to my point. And same thing over here. So come out about right there. and connect. There. Now we have the heart in for our bear. And then, so then let's draw the, um, the feet. So right in this area that we have the heart, I'm going to come right here and draw an oval. Nice big oval. And it's going to touch the heart. And come out. So my goal is to have this foot just slightly um, lower than the tip of the heart. So go right there and connect. There. So it's an oval that's kind of slanting this way. And we're going to do the same thing on the other side. So I'm just going to drag this point across. About right there just so I know where my other foot should go. And once again, I'm going to drag the bottom point. So I'll go right here, just so I know, approximate. There. And don't worry if it's not exactly the same, it won't be. <laughs> We're just aiming to have it in the same area. I'm going to make mine a little bit wider. Okay, so then from there, let's um, go ahead and connect it. So right here, just going to connect it with a curve. And to the other side. So it's just a very simplified way to draw the feet. Okay, so then from there, let's come in here for some details and um, I'm going to draw another oval at the bottom and three ovals right here. So one, two, and three. So same thing over here. And then um, let's finish the head, right? So right here, we're just going to go ahead and tuck it right in. Okay. 
and let's see here am i missing anything i think that's pretty much it should round that part off that part looked weird right <laughs> And that is pretty much it. I really hope you love this cute little bear holding a heart and it inspires you to draw it for someone that you love today. Thanks so much for watching. And if you loved it, please make sure to subscribe if you haven't already and turn on your notification bell so you won't miss any new Draw So Cute videos. See you later.